Well, we're the, the uh, piece de resistance down at the uh, Peoria Home Show. We've got Ted Sheeler here down the opportunity to walk through a house within a house from Homeway Homes. Good morning, Ted. Good morning. Well, we're excited to be here. You've got a house here you have set up in, uh, you know, in a couple days. Tell us, first of all, how does, how does this work as far as, now, if I'm somebody, I want to buy a house, how does the whole system work? Well, most people will start uh, by coming out to our model home center in Goodfield. Uh, we've got three model homes on display out there, a uh, showroom that can show all the products, how we build a home, and uh, sit down and design and uh, build you a home. And there are options that you have when you when you um, decide which home you want, correct? Absolutely. We really are a custom builder. Okay. Uh, we, we build what you want and how you want it. All right, well, let's talk. Let's go ahead and go through and kind of take a look at what is here. And you can kind of talk to me about, you know, the process and how the whole system works, all right? Very good. Okay, well, all these fun and exciting people walking through, we'll just kind of join them and see what they're enjoying. Um, now, as far as out here on the, on the front, um, what, I, you know, I, I'm going to kind of let you take the lead here and tell me kind of what we have. Okay, this home was uh, designed specifically for a, a customer that uh, this home was going to be going up in Chillicothe after the home show. And uh, they picked out all their exterior selections, all their interior selections, uh, and we build it to their specifications. Okay. And well, in through the front door here, and we um, roll on in. We'll get up here with all the people also enjoying the home. Um, all right, uh, talk a little bit about what, we've, what we're seeing here. Well, one of the aspects of this home is it's got a, a lot of flexibility, whether it's for first-time home buyers, for move-up home buyers, or for uh, empty nesters looking to retire. Well, with this home, we've got a split bedroom design. We've got a master bedroom suite on one side, the two secondary bedrooms on the other side. Uh, and we created this with an open great room where the, the living room, kitchen, dining is all one big great room, which seems to be the trend in home design right now. Now, how, now as far as colors, walls, and all of those, do, is that something, I, 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 some of this is going to sound silly, but I've never done this before as far as buying a home. Do, does it come with the, with the walls color? That, that's all something that's done in the last couple days. Right. right. Um, we use the old Henry Ford adage that you can get it any color you want as long as it's home way white. Um, <laughs> but in this particular home, we partnered with East Peoria High School's interior design team. And they came in and did all the decorating, all the paint colors, uh, did, selected all the furniture uh, to decorate this home for the show. And the uh, customers that are buying the home like uh, most of what they see here, and they're going to keep most of it. So, we at Matt Freck, we had the opportunity to talk and have a nice interview with those with those young folks. So we talked about everything that they did and what they chose. Um, as far as the construction and putting this together, tell me about how long does this take? How, here, I mean, I was like down here the first day the setup was, and the next day I was down here and it was pretty much put together. How long, how's the whole, long the whole process take? Well, this is the 12th year that we've put a home in the Civic Center for the home show. You got it figured out pretty well, yeah? We got it down pat pretty good. Uh, we started this Tuesday morning, and uh, we're finished by noon on Friday, uh, and the show opened Friday afternoon. All right, well, let's kind of wander through here and... Um, I guess kind of share what as we as we look around what things here are um, you know standard or you know and well, most of the features in this house you'll see are standard features uh, a few of the upgraded options that the customers chose in this home are the nine foot ceilings um, the uh, six panel oak doors is an upgrade um, that's pretty much it everything else you see here is pretty standard so we've got the um, the kitchen, the open room. Now, can you choose to close off? I mean, is that an option as well? Absolutely. Yeah, they, they wanted the great room concept here, uh, but you could shut this wall off and make it just a small opening if you wanted more of a formal living room, formal dining room area. This is a master bedroom suite, a uh, large walk-in closet, uh, separate master bath. Go ahead and keep talking. He'll get that. Um, it's got dual his and her vanities in the master bath with a corner uh, tub in the center. Then a separate area for the, the shower and the commode. Um, is there a, how do these homes come? How does it, you know, when I, so I come in, I come, I take a look, I decide what I want. How does that process work? Well, the homes come in modules and it can be anywhere from two to eight, ten modules. We can build any design of home. It just depends on how many modules it takes to do that. And those are all built in our construction facility in Deer Creek. Okay. Typically, our basements, uh, we're doing them on 95% of our homes, and those are being built on the site while the, the home is being built in the construction facility. So as the time frame goes on, uh, we cut the cycle time to build a home about in half of most builders. We've got two secondary bedrooms on this end of the home. 
uh, they students chose to decorate this one as a den. Uh, kind of shows our flexible living area where people can use this as a den, an exercise room, a, a separate TV room if they want. But it gives them flexibility in their design. They don't have to have it just as a bedroom. And you know, you, you say that, and it's it's so important for folks to know. That people think, you know, we talk about. Um, well, modular over here, oh gosh, it's all going to be the same. I, tell you, I have been in about three or actually four of these homes um, over the few years, and it's, it really is different when I walk in, depending on what the person does. I mean, you wouldn't know that we're dealing with a uh, um, home way home if it wasn't for, you know, the fact that I knew I was coming to a home way home. Yeah, absolutely. And this is? This is a girl's room, a secondary bedroom. Again, it goes with our uh, women-centric uh, design philosophy that there's four major areas that... Uh, women look for in their home design. Uh, one is de-stressing areas, which would be their, their master bedroom suites where they can go and get away from the kids, get away from the husband and relax. Uh, the second would be storage areas, and you'll notice uh, most all bedrooms have walk-in closets. A lot of uh, good utilized space. There's no wasted space in this house. Uh, so there's plenty of closet space uh, for storage. Uh, the entertaining areas, and that's where we saw out in the great room. Uh, more people nowadays are wanting to entertain in their cooking, in their uh, uh, when they have people over and want to keep that open so they can interact with everybody. Um, and uh, the fourth area is the flexible living areas we just saw in the, the den that, you know, different rooms can be used for different purposes depending on how you live in your home. All right, having gone through now um, the home way home here inside a home of the Civic Center, uh, Ted, tell me um, what other information as far as insulation and all those things that come involved with this. Well, you know, as we walked through the home, we saw a lot of the uh, nice stuff and the pretty stuff that uh, everybody sees in home. But where the home really uh, can benefit the customer is the way it's built. And uh, with the new energy codes out, they're really trying to promote a good sealed building envelope and uh, make it very energy efficient. And one of our signature products uh, in every home we build has the energy strength insulation system. It's a two pound closed cell foam insulation, uh, adds 50% uh, more rigidity to the building, and it completely seals off any air infiltration through the home. If you have an outlet, like you see here, we foam from the outside in so we're completely sealing around that outlet. You're not going to get any drafts around any outlets or any light fixtures or anything like that. And it also adds a lot of strength to it. Where if this was a traditional fiberglass ceiling and you stepped on this, you'd step right through oh, yeah. into the, the lower <laughs> level. Where this, you can step right on it, uh, adds a lot of strength. It's a moisture barrier. It doesn't allow any moisture to get in and it won't mold or mildew. I um, grew up in a, a small farmhouse, a uh, big farmhouse, uh, when I was little, and I know about the drafts through the, uh, just about everything had drafts through it, so it's a totally different situation, too. And then this uh, display here shows our... Let me, let, me roll over, let me roll over here so can, he can see it and we can listen to you. This is simulating heat in your home down here and the different types of insulation that the uh, consumer can use. And it shows how with fiberglass and with cellulose, that air infiltration goes right through that insulation. But with the foam, there's absolutely no air infiltration. We've got 22 standard floor plans uh, that we start with, and uh, we hardly ever build the same house twice. We allow the customers to customize that to meet their needs and meet their lifestyles. Now what if I want a, um, a, um, let me th a second floor? Do I have that option? Yes, uh, we've got some two-story plans. But if you like the, the main floor of one plan and the second floor of another plan, we can combine them. Mix and match. Yeah. <laughs> Let's talk again real quick. How does the process work? So if I'm interested in um, maybe a building, how, how do I go about What do I do? First thing to do is come to our model home center out in Goodfield. Um, sit down with a new home consultant. He'll find out what you are looking for in your new home. We can uh, design it, uh, price it out, and get it ready to build for you. Be ready to go. Can you give me an idea? I know that it's all, all of it's based on what people choose and all that, and every, but everybody, you know, you want to have an idea. What are we talking about cost-wise that at least people can kind of say, okay, here's the ballpark? As a rule of thumb, you can probably start around $90 a square foot, and it, it can go up to $110, $120 a square foot. Depending on how fancy, fancy you want to be, right? Exactly. <laughs> All right, so thank you very much.